Hey everyone, welcome to my channel. And today we're going to be talking about how to germinate seeds. Now, for this method, you only need a few items. A water bottle, hydrogen peroxide, your grow media that you're going to be placing your seeds in. The seeds you're using, we're going to be using a heirloom organic lettuce seed. This is a Willow Rosa. It's a beautiful purple and green color. Grows really nicely. I've, I've experienced it, tasted it. Really delicious. And if you look right here, approximately 1,200 seeds in this one packet. I mean, that's pretty good for 249 only. You can't really beat that. And this is from Mountain Valley Seed Company. If anybody's interested in getting it, you could click the link down below. You'll be able to purchase these seeds. And if you want to just see real quick what the plant looks like, this is an example of a Willow Rosa plant, lettuce plant. This is a, about a, almost a month old. I would say about maybe three weeks, maybe three weeks and a few days. And you can see it's nice, beautiful, green and purple. I mean, this is like one leaf. It's almost the size of my hand, the length of my hand. And beautiful so yeah let's get to it what we're gonna do is take the water bottle open it up this is just plain water nothing mixed in yet we're gonna take the hydrogen peroxide and you want to take about a cap full I would say that's about it and you just want to pour it inside the water bottle And give that a good little stir. And that's it, we got our solution. Now what you want to do is take your the rock wool, if you're going to be using rock wool. Also, you'll be able to find the link down below for all these items. Just submerge it in some water. Let that soak for a few minutes. We'll come back in a few minutes. Now, it's been a few minutes, about five minutes soaking. We just want to take that out. And place that down. Let's wipe our hands. This way we have nice dry hands. And we want to take our seeds. And these are going to be really small, tiny seeds. So you just want to take a like a couple. I usually put a bob two to three seeds in each rock wool cube and then I basically thin them out as they get older. So I'm going to put these in. I'm putting in right now two to three seeds in each pod. And let's put these back in for our next screw. Now remember, you want to have clean hands when you're doing this. And what you want to do is you don't want this to be open. You just want to give it a little bit of a pinch. And it'll close up the hole. Now don't worry about being a little rough with this rock wool. It could take it. And that's it. Now what you want to do is take this, put it in a little, either like a Ziploc bag or maybe like a little container that, for example, let me show you what I use. Here's a little plastic container that I made myself. I just took the, a regular neck, neck cup, I cut out the bottom, and then I took this, cut out a hole, and just placed it inside. This way it has nice circulation when you place it inside. It creates a nice humidity inside and it's perfect for germinating the seedlings. So what you do is just place that inside. It's already nice and soaked and you close that up and you place that in a place that in a nice warm spot. It doesn't even need to be too sunny. Just something above like 70 degrees. 
and in about a, I would say two to four days, you should probably see something popping up. And we'll be back soon to see what, what comes up. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe. Thanks.